Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we're gonna be building an airliner. Yeah, this, uh, the scrimmering videos are over. I, I don't want to do them anymore. Like, I don't know, I'll probably come back to it in the future, but for right now we're gonna go ahead and build an airliner. So, the airliner has to fit in this little thingamabobby right here. It has to have 30 seats in. I'm gonna go with 30 seats because we can't build something super sized because this hangar is not very big. Um, so yeah, 30 seats is good. That is not including the pilot and the co-pilot or the air hostesses, I don't think. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and go and build it. Yeah. Alright, so the first thing I want to do is I want to work on the cockpit. We'll go ahead and build the cockpit first and yeah, hopefully it'll end up looking quite good. So... To be a 30-seater aeroplane, we're going to have to make it relatively big. It's going to have to be, you know, a decent size. So we're going to bring this forwards, and we're going to try and make it look cool. So let's go ahead and add these pieces right here. We'll go out forwards a little bit, and then we'll probably end up coming in slightly like so. Yeah, there we go. All right, cool. And that'll end up looking somewhat like this. So we'll go and build this here like so. And yeah, something like that. Yeah, that's good. That is good. For a start, at least, that is good. Alright, cool. So, yeah, that'll be like our bonnet, if that makes any sense at all. Basically, the pilots will be sat somewhere, like, right here. Um, let's go ahead and add some windows for the pilots real quick. And then I'll show you guys what I mean. So, we'll go ahead and grab this. Alright, good. And that'll go to the side, at least a little bit. So, we'll put the, it right there. Yep, that sounds good to me. And then we'll go ahead and add one of these to the side of that. Yes, probably, like, oh... This goes on a weird way, doesn't it? It does. Because it should go on maybe like this. Yeah, hold on. Boop. Like so. Like that. There we go. That's not too bad at all. That is not too bad at all. All right, cool. Go ahead and get the other piece as well. We need one of these that goes in the middle, basically. So one goes right here. Yep, we'll go ahead and turn that around and we'll put it right there. Yeah, beautiful. All right, cool. This is how I build most of my cockpits, by the way. So if you guys see me build another plane kind of like this one, then uh, you guys know where I got it from. I just, I always build it from the cockpit up and it generally looks the same as the one that I built previously because, you know, I like the one that I built previously. So it kind of makes sense, really. Um, right, okay, on the top, we're going to go ahead and have like two of these. All right, they're going to go sort of like this and then we're going to fill the rest in with blocks. All right, because uh, that makes sense to me. There we go, good. I feel like that looks actually pretty nice. Uh, we're also going to add side windows as well because I do like to see out as I'm looking around. Um, I like to see out the side. So we'll go ahead and build that there as well. And we'll cover the top piece. And that is a pretty decent looking cockpit. Or at least the start of a cockpit. Alright, cool. On the side of here, we don't want it to be completely flat. So we'll go ahead and add one of these pieces. We'll add a piece right there. And we'll try and make this look nice. So on the side, we're going to add one of these, obviously, like this. And we're going to add one of these as well. All right, cool, good. And then we're going to have it go sideways while it goes down, if that makes any sense at all. So like this, probably about two, or maybe even three. Yeah, three seems good. And then we're going to basically copy the top onto the bottom. So we're going to go like this with one of these, flip it around a little bit, put it right there. We're going to grab one of these, and it's going to go right, oh, right there, like that. And yeah, that is looking pretty good. We're going to add one more piece, turn it around, and we're going to make it go sideways while also going backwards. So somewhat like this. All right, yeah, nice. That is not looking bad at all. There we go, good. All right, cool, we'll do that. Uh, then it's obviously going to go inwards at least a tiny bit. So we'll go like this. There we go. We'll do it on all of them. Blammo. And yeah, that is, that is starting to look pretty nice. Starting to look pretty nice indeed. All right, cool. We're going to go ahead and add one of these as well right here. Spin it around a little bit. And voila. Yeah, that's good. That is pretty good. All right, cool. Put that right there. We're going to do the exact same thing on the bottom, pretty much. So we need to somehow match that up. In fact, actually, I might find it easier if I do it from the top. If that makes any sense. I think it does. I think it makes some sense. All right, cool. We're going to go this way a little bit, and we're going to delete these ones. All right, cool. We're going to keep it, like, three wide at the front at all times, pretty much. We're going to always fill in the gaps, though. So we'll do that, that, and then all of this. Yep. All right, nice. And that should allow us to have a really nice um, forward movement. Yeah, really nice forward movement. Uh, and that sounds like a good thing. So, yeah. We'll go forwards a little bit more, like so. Uh, so this one's three, this one will be two, then the next one will be one. And that's probably where we're going to close it off. So, yep, that's okay with me. We'll go ahead and put that right there. 
And we'll try building some fronty bits. Some fronty bits. Uh, like this. Yeah. All right, cool. Good. Delete that, that, and that. And we'll go down as a three. Like so. And you know what? That seems like it's jutting out a little bit too far. Delete this one. There we go. I feel like this is the right place to put it. So we will. We'll put it right here. Bam! All right, beautiful. We'll bring it across. And that doesn't look very good at all. That doesn't look very good at all. I feel like the way I had it before is actually all right. So if we go ahead and we put this back. Come on! Put it right there. Yeah, that looks good. We'll put one of these on there as well. Yep. And we'll put it across. We might as well. Or in fact, actually, what does it look like if I fill in the entire thing with these? I know that doesn't make much sense. But if I do this, and then we do this as well, we can sort of sort out the top bit as we go along. Uh, and I feel like we can. I feel like we can. Yeah. And the sides need to come forwards a little bit more as well. But other than that, I feel like it looks all right. Um, right, okay, cool. Go ahead and fill in one of these. Whoop. Go ahead and fill in one of these as well. We'll put it sideways. And we'll do that. And we'll pretty much do it all the way for all of these. There we go. There we go. And then a flat one on the front. Yep. Yeah, there we go. Now that looks very strange. But if we go ahead and we copy this and we put it on the top, if that makes sense. I keep saying this. If that makes any sense. If that makes any sense. Uh, we'll go ahead and try it. Here we go. So we'll fill in all of it. There we go. All of that, please. We'll have all of this as well. We'll go ahead and cut it. No, we won't. We'll copy it. We'll then flip it upside down. And we'll spin it around. We'll drop it downwards, all right, somewhat like this, and we'll paste it right there. Paste. There we go. Good. Yeah, so that's what we've got to work with right now. Does it look good to me? Yes. I'm okay with that. I'm happy with the way this thing looks. All right, cool. Good. We'll merge these together. Boop, boop, boop. There we go, and that looks, uh, that looks fine. We will extend this one forwards a tiny bit, but other than that, I think it looks all right. I think it looks pretty good. Pretty good indeed. All right, delete these. We're going to go backwards using the whole thing. There we go. We're going to do this as well. All right, turn it around. Bring it this way. And yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy with that front end. That looks all right to me. All right, cool. Go ahead and fill in the last bits of these, though. We need like three across. That's good. We want it to go up probably a little bit, at least here. So we'll go up one more. But we'll do it inside one. All right, so like this. And we'll go like this. Boop. And yeah, we'll fill that in pretty much. So we will. There we go. Good. Yeah, that is not bad at all. Go ahead and turn these around, put it right there, and do the same thing with all these. Yeah, that is looking all right. That is looking just fine. All right, cool. Um, let's go here. We'll go upside down. We'll flip it around. We'll bring it outwards. Yeah. Uh, we'll fill in this little gap as well. Um, yeah. All right, cool. Go ahead and fill this in. Good. Go ahead and fill this in as well. It is a little bit boxy for right now, but we can actually work on that, so... That's not something to worry about. We'll go ahead and fill in the bottom piece. And that's our front. That is our cockpit pretty much done. Now, we do need to, like, make it look a little bit nicer. So, we'll delete a bunch of these. We'll try and make it come forwards a little bit. Once it's forwards a little bit, I think it'll look a lot nicer. All right, so we'll do this. We'll flip this one around. We'll put it right there. And we'll do this. Yeah, and we'll do this. Yep, and we'll put one of these right here. And we'll fill in that little hole. Yeah, that makes it look a little bit nicer. We'll do the same thing with this one right here. One, two, three, and that's probably enough. In fact, actually, we'll do four and five. There we go, good. And we'll make these come upwards as well. There we go, we'll do that. We'll do the same thing right here as well. And we'll probably delete this. Yeah, there we go. Do this, sideways, whoop. And we'll do this as well. Yeah, all right, cool, that is nice. That's pretty nice. Um, right, okay, now we need to work on where the pilots are gonna sit. So let's go ahead and get a pilot seat. And we'll have two pilots, because that's generally what you have. And we'll put them in, like, sideways. Yeah. But they need to be over to the right at least one. So we'll put, like, a block across here. And we'll try and fit them to it. Yeah, fit them to the block. There we go. Pretty good. Pretty good indeed. All right, good. Delete the block now. We don't need it. We don't need the block anymore. And, yeah, they're going to sit in there just like that. Let's go ahead and spawn it in. We'll go ahead and sit inside. And we'll see if we can see out of all of the windows. And if we can... That's good. Yes, we can indeed. All right, pretty good. Let's go ahead and paint it as we go along as well, because um, that seems to be a good idea. Uh, I don't want to do that. I want these pieces on the top to be this color, like so. And then the rest of the plane is going to stay white for right now, but we will end up changing that to be a different color very soon. We'll also write some words on here as well, because that seems like a good plan. Also, the plane might change into a different plane as we go along. It's, it's going to start as an airliner. But we might do different variants. We'll have to see. Um, yeah, 
All right, okay, so now I want to go ahead and work on some sort of window system. Not window system, some door system, okay? So we're going to go outwards a little bit right here. We're going to continue the shape on the top for pretty much the entire plane because uh, I feel like it looks all right. It does look fine. Um, and yeah, we'll go ahead and put these in as we go along. Boop, boop. And we'll do the bottom piece as well a Rooney. There we go, we'll do this. And we'll build it across the bottom. All right, cool. So the door is going to have to go on the side. Um, I'm kind of thinking that we'll have a door that literally just opens sideways like a normal door would. Whether that's a good idea or a bad idea, I'm not so sure. Maybe we can have the door open then some stairs or ladders fall down, because that would be pretty nice. Um, but no, I'm thinking that we have a door that's literally just this big. Like this big, and it folds this way. Because we will be quite low to the ground, I think. Alright, let's go ahead and get ourselves a hinge. One hinge, please. It's going to be a normal hinge. And we're going to go ahead and put it in the side. Like right here. It's only going to be three big. That's okay. And yeah, we'll put it right there. All right, cool. So, the door is going to be this big. There we go. Go across about two. Yep. Go up and all the way up to there. Yes. All right, cool. Then on the top of here, we'll go ahead and have a flat bit. In fact, actually, we'll attach it to this. Might as well have it on the door. There we go. And then the rest of it won't be part of the door. Yeah, all right, I think that'll work quite well. We do need to see how it looks when it opens, but I think it'll work out quite okay. Quite okay. All right, good. Go ahead and fill in the floor right there. And we'll fill in the top bit right here as well. One, two, and three. One, two, and three. Oh, and four. <laughs> One, two, three, and four. There we go. And this bit too. And then we'll fill in the rest of these like so. Boop and boop. And we might as well delete that one for now. We need to check how this works. So let's go ahead and get a button. We'll actually plumb it in as we go along as well, because that seems like a good idea. Uh, we'll put it right there. There we go. Boop. We'll put it right there. Good. Logicify all that together, so this will go to this. But we can't. It doesn't go to that. Man, why am I so stupid? I need to logicify those two together. I just don't know the button or the, the logic behind it. So what we could do instead is actually add a, a door hinge. Uh, because the door hinges will work the same way, right? But... Do they have a different logic system? Oh, they're the same. They're the same as these. All right, okay, maybe I'm just stupid then. But that works. That will work right there. Uh, and that's pretty good. All right, cool. Go ahead and fill the side in. And we'll delete this. We'll put in a new one of these. Yep, we'll put it in right there. We'll put in the top piece as well. And we'll basically fill in all around the door. And that should work pretty nicely. Yeah, all right, cool. Fill in all of these pieces. Boop, boop. That is looking pretty nice. It's looking pretty nice. It does sort of look like a military aircraft at this point, though, so we'll have to fix this. We'll have to sort it out. Um, but yeah, for right now, it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. Um, and yeah, I will leave this here for now. So, let's go see if we can just push the door open, and we'll see how tall it is. It's probably going to be not tall enough. Push it. No, we can't push it open. For some reason, we can't push it open. That's very strange. Uh, but yeah, for now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys for watching. I'm going to change the front bit a little bit because I don't like how this bit sticks out so much. We'll end up changing that a little bit. Uh, but for right now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have any suggestions or know what kind of logic I need for this, then let me know in the comments down below. And we'll continue to build this in the future. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.